What's up guys, this is Bolash from Racing Brick. Not too long ago I reviewed the 31199 Marvel Studios Iron Man set from the LEGO Art series. From a building experience perspective I was not the biggest fan of it since it is very repetitive and I'm not fond of the adult coloring box either, but it looks fantastic when it is finished as a decoration or as a piece of art. The possibility to build a bigger picture using three sets was really exciting for me, so I could not wait long to get two other sets and then have it built. The process is exactly the same as the smaller one, but first you need to disassemble that. It is not very exciting to do, especially if you want to sort all the pieces meanwhile. Instructions for the big version can be downloaded from lego.com. As you see, the steps are very similar to the previous one, you simply need to build more. One thing I need to emphasize, prepare a big table or build it on the floor, as the end result will be big, I mean really big. It is 120cm by 40cm and looks absolutely amazing. The smaller version was pretty sturdy and could be handled easily, but this is very different. You definitely need someone to help if you want to move it around, otherwise it will quickly fall apart. But when it is finally in place, the result is simply stunning. This is not the final place for me, just took it here for the shot. I advise to break it down to three smaller pieces for storage and to be able to move it, much easier to handle this way. So how much does it cost altogether? If you buy it directly from LEGO, that will be 3 times 120 euros, so that's 360. You can get it for about 90 euro per piece elsewhere, but that will still set you back 270 euros. For that amount you can buy some big and impressive LEGO sets with more interesting building and play experience for sure. But I think this set, especially in this combination, is very different. You simply need to decide if such an impressive DIY home decoration piece is worth this amount for you, and I'm sure the answer will be yes for a lot of people. Now there's only one very important question remaining, whose room will be the lucky one having this in our future home? I'm sure I will have a long conversation about it with my son, I still need to collect some good arguments why I absolutely need it in the LEGO room. Wish me luck! Please let me know your thoughts in the comments, if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up, you can also subscribe and tap the notification bell if you don't want to miss my LEGO reviews and other LEGO RC videos. See you next time, bye bye!